guys, welcome to another video, and today we are taking a look at one of my favorite predators from North America. This is the grizzly bear. Now, grizzly bears are a subspecies of brown bear. These guys can stand a total of 8 feet tall and weigh in somewhere between 400 to 1,500 pounds. They inhabit western Canada and northwestern United States. Grizzlies can move pretty quickly for their size, moving at around 35 miles an hour, if need be. They eat a wide range of food. The food ranges from nuts, insects, all kinds of plant matter, uh, fungi, fruits, salmon, rodents, and carrion, um, as well as potentially other animals as well. As winter draws closer, these guys are going to spend summer really putting on weight. Each day, the bear needs to take in around 90 pounds of food. Uh, they need about 20,000 calories each day, and they can gain anywhere from 2 to 3 pounds each day. Now, the bears may hibernate, for five to seven months and when the bear wakes up from hibernation they potentially will have lost somewhere between 15 percent to 30 percent of their body weight females who go into labor do so during hibernation and they'll wake up prior to birthing the mother will usually have two cubs and the cubs are born blind hairless and toothless Mothers go back into hibernation after the cubs are born. These cubs will stay with mom for two to three years. Now, sadly, nearly half of all cubs will not survive their first year of life. Unlike the adults, cubs may be preyed upon by wolves, mountain lions, and even adult male grizzly bears. A female bear, however, is very protective over her cubs. Grizzly bears are a subspecies of brown bear. The other species um, that inhabits North America is the Kodiak bear. And we'll talk about them um, perhaps a little bit later in the video. Actually, no, we, we're going to be doing another video on them later. A female bear already said that these guys are a threatened species in North America and they are protected in the lower 48 states but supposedly not in Alaska brown bears came from Europe and Asia and entered North America via that land bridge between Asia and North America bear cubs can climb trees while adults do not Their claws are up to four inches long, and they can live 40 years in captivity. It's one of, as I already mentioned, one of two species of brown bear in North America. The other species, like I said, is the Kodiak bear. You know that classic hump? Yeah, this hump right here. That is pure muscle. Brown bears once lived throughout the west and down into mexico and they would have lived throughout the great plains and especially along rivers they have been eliminated from about 98 percent of their original habitat so that is a little bit about the grizzly bear thank you for watching my video Hope you have a great week. Please feel free to subscribe if you're not. Give this video a like. And click that notification bell so you know when my next video is coming out. And with that, I will say goodbye.